Hello everyone, my name is Jai Sony and this is my unboxing video of Sony Xperia C5 Ultra Dual and as you can see it's still sealed. Here are some specs, it's got Bravia Mobile Engine 2, Xmore RS camera sensor. As you all know Sony Xperia C series phones comes with a front flash and now Sony has got a name for that feature. They are calling it selfie flash and the screen is of full HD resolution. There are some more specs, it's got 2 days uh, 2930 mAh battery, a MediaTek 6752 octa-core chipset, 13MP rear facing camera and 13MP a front facing camera too, a 6 inch full HD IPS display with autofocus HDR and uh, it's also got uh, almost a bezel less design around the sides. Let's tear the seal and open the box now. Sony already updated its Sony Xperia C3 two months ago with Sony Xperia C4 and now they have updated it again with Sony Xperia C5. So here's the phone and it doesn't feel that big in hand. It's almost closer to a, 5 point, a phone with 5.5 inch display. Thanks to the bezel less design I guess. It's a unibody phone, the back doesn't come off and this is kind of not good but the back is pure glossy black. It's also called piano black finish as you can see. All the scratches and the scuff marks are going to be easily viewable on this back. So using a back cover or flip cover is advisable for this phone. This is the first time I'm using a phone with 6 inch screen by the way, I've never used a phone with 6 inch screen before. Oh and uh, it's available for around 30,000 rupees. Its MRP is around 30,000 rupees in India but it's selling for around 25,000 rupees in the market and online. Here are the rest of the stuff, a charger which is not an Indian pin, earphone standard earphones usb cable startup guide let's take this off and turn it on now so this is the 13 megapixel front camera with the led flash as you can see and this is the full hd 6 inch display and it almost have no bezels around the sides as you can see it's all screen from here to here which is a good thing this is the speaker this is the earpiece on the right hand side power button volume button and also the camera button the back sony look another 13 megapixel camera with led flash and its own mic at the top 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and on the left hand side Here's a dual sim tray. It supports two nano sim as you can see. And this is the micro SD card slot. This phone comes with the same processor as the C4, but its camera is actually an update. For some reason the NFC always comes turned on on all the Sony phones with NFC that I've used. Here's the Android version of this phone, Android version 5.0 Lollipop, which is not the latest anymore, the latest is the Android M Marshmallow processor info. This is the 16 GB version and let's see how much we will get out of 16 GB. You will get only half of it as you can see, a little more than half, 8.82 GB available. And that when I have not installed anything yet on this phone. Let's see if this supports USB OTG or not. So here's the pen drive. Let's see. And it does support USB OTG as you can see. USB storage. So that's a good thing. This piano finish of this phone feels really good in hands actually. It feels really premium in hand and 
Surprisingly, even though it's it has a six inch display, it doesn't feel that big and it's it feels quite easily usable with one hand. So that's a very good thing. This is like a limit though for a smartphone screen. I don't think they should go over this. Like practically even a seven in, a, a tablet with seven inch screen is usable with one hand. You can hold it with one hand. But uh, they shouldn't make phones with that bigger screen, in my opinion. Anyway, we'll we will see if that happens in the future. For now, let's let's take this out. Let's see how much bloatware it comes with. There's not that much bloatware in it, but still, it has taken uh, quite a lot of storage for some reason. Here's the back camera of this phone. Back camera is the same as the C4. So that's not what we want to see right now. What I want to see right now is the 13 megapixel front camera. So here it is. This is screen is almost, this whole phone is almost the size of my hand as you can see. My hand looks smaller in this screen. Let's try with the flash. So here's the one with flash and here's the one without flash. And the photo looks really really good and rich in details too unlike uh, the C4. As you can see you can clearly see the lines, the tiny little lines on my hand the detail is really good and the lighting it picks up it looks really natural and here's the one with the flash it comes with this soft skin effect for the front facing camera and here are our usual sony presets Just to give you an idea of this size, of the size of this phone, as you can see, its height is almost is equal to the height of the box, almost. So that's the size of this phone, but surprisingly, like I said, it doesn't feel that big in hand because of its almost bezel-less design. And just to make sure that this phone does not have dual stereo speakers, I'm going to play a song to show you that only this uh, speaker grill at the bottom is the actual speaker and this is just an earpiece. See? Because of this uh, dual, uh, because of this similar kind of uh, speaker grill design at the bottom and the top uh, people could get confused you know so as you saw this is not a speaker this is just an earpiece and this is the actual speaker anyway for more about this phone please stay tuned for my full review and uh, if you have any queries about this phone uh, you can ask me in the comment section below if you like the video, please like and subscribe to my channel Automatic and thanks for watching.